Good day everyone. Today we want to present about polarization. Electrochemical polarization can be defined as the change in electrode potential due to the flow of a current. It is also an accelerated method to study the effect of potential and current to a sample. There are three types of polarization which are activation polarization, concentration polarization and ohmic polarization. Activation polarization is a polarization caused by a slow electrode reaction while concentration polarization is caused by the concentration changes in reactants or products near an electrode surface. The ohmic polarization is the polarization caused by the IR drops in solution. Polarization can be distinguished into anodic polarization and cathodic polarization. In anode polarization, the electrode potential becomes more positive and the process of changing electrode potential will occur in positive direction. It acts more anodic and oxidation occurs in this polarization. In contrast, the electrode potential in cathodic polarization becomes more negative and the process of changing electrode potential occurs in the negative direction. Cathodic polarization acts more cathodic and reduction will occur in this polarization. Anodic polarization is used to measure and protect surfaces against corrosion whereas cathodic polarization is used to protect the surface against the corrosion when potential difference is reduced to a minimum value. Potentiodynamic corrosion test is a polarization technique which is used to provide useful information regarding corrosion mechanisms, corrosion rate and the susceptibility to corrosion of certain materials in various environments. Polarization measurement can be done as shown in the figures where three electrode configuration are employed in the electrolyte. In this potentiodynamic polarization profile, corrosion rate and linear polarization resistance are determined. It also shows the relationship between the potential and log of current density which is also referred to as corrosion rate. In typical polarization graph, a point is OCP or rest point, B is active region, C is passivation potential, E is passive region, F is trans-passive region and lastly G is secondary passivity. To take note, as the applied potential is increased in positive direction from the open circuit potential, the current density will also increase, initiating more corrosion activity. From the potentiodynamic polarization curve, above the corrosion potential is anodic slope while below it is cathodic slope. Based on this curve, Stern-Geary equation is also used to determine the corrosion rate. The higher the RP value, the better the corrosion resistance. Passivation occurs when an oxide layer forms a continuous film on metal surface that prevents further oxidation. Pitting occurs due to the delocalized breakdown of a passive film. At stage 1, the dissolution or passivation occurs, followed by stage 2, the oxide layer breakdown and repassivation occurs again at stage 3. That's all for our presentation. Thank you for listening.